literature is one of the greatest support that we have to uh, approach in an ethical way to our patient. So everything we do is supported by literature. It's a really beautiful location and a really beautiful venue. A lot of people are coming and a lot of people join the lecture and this is really important and really nice. I'm grateful and I'm happy to be here. My lecture was about the treatment plan in restorative and in prosthetics. And I talked about the way in which we program and we execute both uh, the restorative procedures and the prosthetic ones and uh, uh, we work as a team so it was uh, an interdisciplinary way to uh, approach to the problem and uh, in my lecture I talked about the way in which we treat uh, both anteriors and posteriors with direct and indirect techniques for the restorative and the way in which we treat all uh, the prosthetics problems such as the constructions of the provisionals and uh, passing through the uh, mounting of the plaster and to the uh, permanent uh, uh, crowns to end the prosthetic uh, workflow. My brother works with me, he's a perio-surgeon and implantologist and uh, I'm talking about of course to, uh, of my dental technician too, with which uh, I communicate by pictures, by phone directly in office and uh, it's really important to, jo to create uh, the, the right uh, environment uh, in which we, we have to work and to communicate each other, to develop the strategies to project first of all and then to realize the, the treatment plans. The keys are, first of all, you have to, to take pictures of the clinical case, x-rays, you have to collect all the data you need and take your time to, to develop the treatment plan. So the keys are, of course, the time and the brain that you use to create the correct approach, the correct treatment plan that must be developed in time. I've been using, in all my clinical cases, the photography as a, a way to communicate and a way to create my treatment plans. I'm not used in using digital smile designs or systems like that because I do prefer the work done into the lab, that means analogic, that means walks up, and that means mock-up for all my treatment plans. I don't know if, I, if in the next future I will try them, but for this moment I, I do prefer to work in, with analogic systems. Talking about CAT CAM, sometimes my technician use that kind of uh, restoration instead of the pressed and painted, for instance. I don't have it in office, I don't want it at, the, at the, that moment, at this moment in office, but in the next future, I don't know. Maybe uh, we, I will start thinking about digital impressions, but at this very moment, I'm not using them. It's a huge question, it's a huge question. I don't know, I think that the simplification of the procedures will help us a lot in reaching our goals. This is sure. But I don't really know where our denti dentistry is going at this moment. But uh, maybe we, with the, the help of the simplification of the techniques, the help of the simplification of the materials, we will reach the same kind of levels using the less efforts to get them. Literature is one of the greatest support that we have to uh, approach in an ethical way to our patient. So everything we do is supported by literature.